Hello ladies and gentlemen, Marauder X here back with more Let's Play Dragon Force, and we got a whole bunch of armies on the move. We're gonna go after Goldark. And that's about it, really. We've got Goldark left. And then we get, you know, a little bit of story, and then a lot more story, and yeah. That's that's pretty much the long and short of it until we get into the the final series of fights. So yeah. Fan tabulous. Alright, I sent people here. Need to recruit. Mostly because those are the people who took out Gaul and Scythe the last time. And I've got Crawford and Nelson who joined me kind of randomly. Alright, so who we got though? We've got Gongos. Gongos can just hang out there, that's fine. Yeah. And don't need to recruit with any of those people. Magistry, we are under attack. Just two, they are Gaul and Scythe. Okay, so... Hey, look, a little story. I've heard that you were chosen one. Perhaps you have also foreseen your end at our hint. No. No. Uh, we're, we're in the middle of nowhere. What sacred ground? So yeah, they are, uh... They are officially servants of magic. We knew this. I'm like, duh. Okay. <clears throat> what are we gonna do? Uh, that's... You shall die at the edge of my mighty blade. Hey, look! It's a little gall. How fabulous. Uh, which, this kind of sucks, because I'm a little injured. Did you learn nothing from Scar? Scar beat the crap out of you, like, 16 times. This is hilarious. And, and, and what do you got? Oh, you got, okay, they've changed troops. So we've got level 18 scythe with 80 zombies, 55 MP! Level 18 Gaul, 90 mages, 63 MP. Crap. Alright, well, that's, that's how this gets played out. Alright, so we're probably not going to be sending Junin <clears throat> just right off the bat. Uh, I could probably send Reinhardt. Yeah, really, if there's anyone that I, I think can do this, it's Reinhardt. Uh, but I've got more than enough people to deal with this, so... I may suffer a couple of losses, but... I'll, I'll win this one. I'd... That 55 MP, though, that is just... That's just ridiculous. Why is that a thing? Alright, yeah, I'm just going to advance. Like... There's... there's no point in... Alright, um... Hmm... Yeah, I'm gonna do that. And the troops can't go anywhere because we have more than enough blocking everything. And they're zombies, so they are ground troops, which means, guess what? Sucks to be you. Not that I was going to have any trouble dealing with these things, but that just made it so much easier. However, this is going to hurt because he hits like a brick shithouse, because he is made out of very large bricks. And she's taking next to no damage. Alright, we'll thunder fall and see if I can do a little bit more damage with that, because if she gets off, it, all it would take is another two summon guardians and Reinhardt's dead. That's... yeah, that's that's not good. Let's just melee. Because it doesn't matter at this point. Just attack her. Don't let her summon her guardian to punch Reinhardt in the face. That is something that we don't want to happen. At all. Okay, now that kind of sucks. Because now I can't run away if I wanted to. 
But it took all of her power to do that, so... But her power meter seems to be increasing ridiculously fast. You are a bitch. Alright, so now Scar would have a hell of a time trying to deal with her. Why? Oh my god. I just lost, like, s hundreds of frames. I have no idea what's going on. I can't focus on her right now. That's... I, I lost, like, 300 frames. That's ridiculous. I guess it's the green on green. I don't know. I did a lot of testing of this before I started playing this game because I knew this one was going to be difficult because of just the sheer number of sprites on screen. But really... That's just... That's ridiculous. Alright, so we've got mages. Um... Yeah, let's send Mikhail. I'm sending my two weakest to level up against two really just higher-end people. So, yeah. That's... that's... F seems like a fantastic idea, doesn't it? And I'm gonna lose more frames because of the... See, I didn't lose frames. I guess it's just... it's the colors. It's... it's... It's the colors and the movement and the... yeah. Like I said, I did a bunch of testing on this to see what would happen. Because I knew... I, I knew the sprites were going to be a problem. Okay. That... I cannot begin to tell you how stupid that was. Because you're in special formation, which means they're not going to be attacking my monarch anymore. But, I mean, you've got 63 MP, so... But I've still got enough MP to do a little bit of damage to you. And you've got enough to do a little bit of damage to me, too. Okay. I'm, uh... Okay. You're... You want to play that way? We can play that way. And Gale Blast do a little bit of damage. Only downside is now his troops are shooting mine. So I've got less troops than he does. But... Oh, you... You just did that. That was not smart. Because I can do this now. And take out even more of your troops. This is just not smart on any level, Billy. However, I may have lost. I need to get one more hit. One more hit. Uh, let's Gale Blast. That should... hopefully put me in a position to where if we duel, I'll win. Maybe! It... it's... it's a solid maybe. <laughs> Alright. We shall meet on the battlefield one-on-one. -on -one. Yeah. Eh, uh, okay, yeah. That's a win. I decapitated him! Perfect! Uh, but yeah, like I said, I, I did a lot of tests, and I... Because I expected things like Meteor Storm to be the, the... the hurting thing in terms of frames, not the actual movement. Uh, we gotta go kill Ramda. Okay, they've got to go defeat Ramda. Uh, that means we got to go save Ramda, but I need to get to a castle to recover a little bit first. Oh, well, they just instantly teleport there. So, oh yeah, I forgot about that. So, Ramda, we don't get. He won't join us at all. You are the traitors for raising your power against me. So it seems like Ramda started off as a follower of Madrick, and he looks kind of like it, you know, red eyes, kind of, you know, emo-style haircut. Now is not the time or place to fight, except... Reconsider the Reckless... what? So yeah, he was a, a servant of, of Madrick. But, unfortunately, they're going to try to kill him.
You have nowhere to. Yeah, he can't leave. And they know. Yeah. Why are you surprised? They're the bad guys. They've been one step ahead of us the entire time. Dragon door. Oh, that I know is just translation. All right, so yeah. Why? What? <laughs> Why did we go all the way over there? That was that was super awkward. All right, so I need to get to a castle and recruit. Let's see. I saw the hourglass flicker, which typically means typically means there's an army headed out somewhere. But I was like, who has an army at this point? There should be no armies. Yeah, I can I can go there. And more story. There's something approaches from the skies. It's a dragon man. Crap! I should have saved. I should have saved uh, Mikhail for that. And all of these castles leveling up. Jesus Christ! And... He's not going to catch me at this point. He had that little boost of, Hey, look, people. I should fight them. And then apparently got distracted. Ah, oh, son of a. Okay. I really didn't think that plan through. So we're gonna send a whole bunch of people out. Uh, Zagat, Presto, Nelson. And I guess Arios. And Army Crawford go over here. And hey look, more skull kids! Jeez, this is just becoming a clusterfuck, isn't it? Okay. Castle. Recruit. Get my troops back up to full. And hey, look, I've got Mikhail back up. Except he's probably going to be very injured at this point. Alright, Scar, as much as I hate to do this to you, I need to take your guys. And I need to give... I need to switch Leon off Monk. Because I'm pretty sure I finally gave him a dragon crest. Yeah, I gave him a dragon crest. Okay. And re recruit the harpies. Alright, let's deal with the dragon man. And let's go over here and find out who is in what castle preparing to uh, deal with those guys. So I got a bunch of archers. Damn it. Really no one of 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 strength, really. Alright, so let's send Riker Ruix Pfeiffer down here. I said down there. Actually, hold on. I don't even really need to do that, because I've got people in... Yeah. I've got a bunch of badasses in this castle. So, screw that noise. I'll just abandon this castle for the moment. And get them out of there. And I'll let my badasses deal with that group. And direct. Go down there. 
Okay. Because in theory, they'll take the shortest route, which would be a straight line across, and they'll run right into Gullen's castle. At least that's what I'm hoping. Alright. Let's see. 127, 16 MP. 127 seems to be the max amount of HP. Damn it, he still only has 55. I don't want to use him. Let's see. Let's, let's send Wen. He's only level 15. 100 dragons versus 100 dragons. I'm expecting to lose a ton of frames in this fight. So if there's any stuttering or jittering, I apologize. Apologize. Yes. And more. Alright. I'm just gonna stand by. And wait for them to meet me head on. And... Sword Rush. Like, at this point, there's really no point in trying to take out too many troops. Like, that's just... Oh my god, he took no damage. And you're not using your typical strategy? Oh, that... That was a dick. That was a dick move. That hurt. Alright, so I can send my... My troops forward. And... Sword Rush again. I'm gonna lose this fight. Just because of how much damage he's doing with... That one freaking attack. And how little damage I'm doing to him. Uh, yeah. Like, it looks like my troops are doing one point of damage to him. Specific. Like, that's... That is ridiculous. Alright. I've only got... I've got 50, so... Melee. And... Sword Rush again. And just one point of damage. Alright, so it looks like he's not attacking me anymore, which is good, because I couldn't handle that. Like, I can't do that. Alright, if it comes down to it, I'm going to have to run. I do not want a, uh, a draw, because I have to beat him. If I don't beat him, I'm just going to have to deal with him over and over again. So, this is going to be fun. If I could get him to use all of his MP on Wen, I will go ahead and send Mikhail. Because then there's nothing he can do to hurt Mikhail. Which means I'd have Samurai against a Dragon Man. Alright, yeah, I'm going to have to run. I'll let me... I'll let Wen get in the last couple of hits that I can. Three... Two, one, retreat! Because I am beating the son of a bitch. I do not care. I'm taking him down. Alright, he still has 5 MP. And. Uh, that means he could take out Mikhail. Alright, so I need someone who's not really injured. I'm gonna send Leon. Yeah, I'll send Leon. He hasn't really done much lately, so we'll send him, deal with it, and see if he can take out. I did about half of his health. This is why I didn't want to mess with Zato. <laughs> because, come on, this is ridiculous. Re freaking ridiculous. Alright, I've got Aura Assault and Cross Rider. We'll do Aura Assault. I don't think it's going to do a lot of damage to him, but 
Oh! Holy crap, it did more than Sword Rush. And... Perfect. Except not, because he can still do, uh... That one... Flame Pedestal. Or, uh, Flame Cannon, not Flame Pedestal. Stone Pedestal. Flame Cannon. I got Stone Pedestal, too. Not that it does Leon any good at this stage in the game. It really does not. Alright, so... Leon will beat him. That's good. Not after taking a hit with... Oh! See? Look at the... the damage. Oh well. I got three hits off of him on with Leon specials, and then my dragons will finish him off. Or not. He's gonna run away. What the hell? Do I, is there a story where I have to beat him with Vangle? Yeah, there is. Yeah. Son of a bitch. Alright. Well then. Well, I'm going to, uh... end this episode here, because I've, uh... Yeah, I, I've pretty much run out of stuff, uh, mostly time. So I will see you guys in the next installment, so till then, later everyone.